Hey, this is What's New in version 11 of Adobe Presenter Video Express. First up, interactive video, and man, is this cool. Now you can create interactive videos using quiz questions. Click on the little cube there with the question mark to start creating a quiz question. Just click on that plus to create a new question, and then you're ready to go. You type directly into the question and answer section in that window that pops up. Choose the answer that's correct. You can even go to multiple responses and choose more than one correct answer if you like. We call it interactive video because you can actually jump to any specific location in the video. Those numbers you see there are time code. They're the second hand. You can see I'm jumping to 50 seconds if the answer is correct. Then I switch to if it answer is incorrect and change the time code to jump. You can add as many questions as you want, even sort them, and you can publish them out to a learning management system using SCORM or publish them to the new Adobe Captivate Prime learning management system. Next up, background personalization. You can personalize that background. Just click on that big make my background awesome button that you see right in the interface. You click on take my snapshot now and automatically Adobe Presenter Video Express will start its work. Draw a vertical line and then a horizontal one from shoulder to shoulder to create the marching ants. Those marching ants indicate the section that will be clipped out. There you can see that I've automatically clipped out the background and replaced it with an image. Click on my preview looks good and then you can start clicking on the background to change through a variety of images that we've provided for you. Even more spectacular, you can adjust the video image of yourself in relationship to that superimposed background. You can even scale that up in size or down, move it around into different locations. Just click that little arc there to reset back to the way it was. See where it says background gray wall? You can choose from a whole library of background images that we've given you. You can also choose to uh, pull something from the screen itself that you've captured or put in a custom background and now you've got multi-video import. Let me show you how it works. You can bring in any video you like. You can even trim the video using this dialog. Once inserted, the video you brought in becomes the screen capture, and now you're free to actually record your own webcam and audio over the video that you brought in. You can even watch the video playback while you do your webcam and audio voiceover. Next up, annotations. Add custom shapes and other annotations, including text, to your projects. Just click the annotations marker to add new custom annotations. You can even move them around in the timeline and move them around on the screen. Quickly and easily change the color and even add text captions right in your video. And just to be sure you have that feeling of a video studio right at your fingertips, we've added video effect filters. Just click that magic wand to enhance the video. Once the video enhancement tab opens, you'll see a video filters listed at the top. Click on the hyperlink for the video filter that's active. We've included a wide variety of different filters that you can automatically apply just by clicking on the preview. Notice along the top that you can choose to apply the effect to just yourself, to just the background, or to yourself and the background at the same time. Easily apply cool custom filters that apply to every frame of the video. Those are just a few of the many amazing new features in Adobe Presenter Video Express. Why not download your own copy and check it out today?